is sensational. Guys, we are on world tour and we are in Chile. Home to beautiful beaches, beautiful women, and not a lot of people know this, but they invented the glory hole. Let's build a squad. Hey guys, and welcome to my world tour squad builder. I am doing Chile, and let me just straight off the bat show you why. 88 team of the season Sanchez, 91 pace, right footed, 5 star skills, 180k, amazing shot on him, amazing dribbling, fast. Uh, one thing I would say, and I've noticed it with a few team of the season players, gets tired quite quick, but um, recovers quite quick as well. Um, and he is a monster and was the inspiration for this Chilean team. Going back down, we have got Bravo in Nets and uh, Bravo to him because he has been very good. He's only 77 rated, he's non-shiny, but um, he has been very solid. He's the highest rating Chilean goalkeeper available. On this side, we have got Contreras. 65 pace, and uh, solid enough, again 77, again non-shiny, but he's just done a job for me. And um, I'm not going to sit here and slag him off because he has been solid enough. On this side, we've got Fuentes, who again, should have been terrible, but has been quite steady. The back four is the weakness of this squad, but um, see what you think as we progress as to whether it's worthwhile or not. As always with uh, these national teams, there is you could t convert them into a hybrid to create an amazing squad. Um, this guy again, Norabura, he is, again, he's been really solid for me. No complaints about him at all. He just does his job and nothing more, nothing less. On the left-hand side, now then, this might be tricky. Let's, uh, let's just have a little look. Ignore what's going on now, guys. On this side, we have a Chilean left mid, again, because of the problems we have had. We have got a left mid here. We've got Bozajor from Birmingham. Now, he is a left midfielder. I've done this just to make the team tick over. It works really well. Obviously, I don't recommend it perfectly, but um, as we'll stick him in at left back here. He gets the, um, the yellow boot at left back and he gets 5 chem, maybe a little bit more, maybe 6 when it's all sorted. But uh, he's got 83 pace, he's got medium defensive work rate, medium attacking. So he does a very steady job for me and he's got enough pace to do the job well. And again, he's done alright for me. Uh, a little bit weird that one, but um, like I say, he's done alright for me. We have got Valdivia at uh, centre mid here on the left hand side. Because of his right foot, he's got a very good shot on him, despite what it says on his card. And he's five-star skill skills, guys, and that's why I picked him over some of the others. We have got Inform Vidal in the centre, and what a shot this guy's got on him. And he's got he's got a real good engine on him. He absolutely races around. And uh, I really like him, really recommend that Inform. On this side, we have got Medell again, Inform Medell. And uh, he is um, quite a steady player at 18k. I should probably tell you Vidal cost 42k. Um, Midel here on the right hand side of the midfield is just really solid. But he's actually he's got I think he's got really good weak foot and uh, he shoots well with both feet. And I have quite enjoyed using him. Up top we have got Sauzu at striker. He um. He's quite quick, he's quicker than 81 pace because he's quite small and nippy and agile. So he does get around really well and he does a good job up top. He's a really good finisher. His shooting stats are excellent as with a lot of informs. And on the left we've got an absolute cherry. Gonzalez at 76 shiny, 91 pace. He's right footed on the left, oh, sorry, he's left footed on the left. But he just, he's class, he's really good at free kicks, really good at penalties. He's got a cracking shot, he's really fast, and I really recommend him, and he's so cheap as well. I definitely recommend him, and he's great. So stay tuned for the highlights, guys. An absolute screamer coming from Sanchez. So stay tuned for that. Cheers. Hey, guys, and welcome to the highlights from Chile. We are watching the highlights from Chile. 
I am going to hijack the audio. Hijack! Um, I just want to say, guys, let me know where you want me to go and we'll tour. I am pretty much toured up to the max right now. If there's a place you want me to go on my tour, I'll get the tickets. I'll book the flight. I'll sort out the hotel, the camera, the woman. Don't you worry about that. Just let me know where you want me to go. Someone said Sweden. I can do that, but it will be uh, Ibrahimovic at centre forward with El Manda at striker, and the rest of the team will be average. Apart from that safari at left back, possibly. Anyway, um, yeah, so, uh, yeah, where do you want me to go? Someone else said Turkey. That could be interesting. Um, I've been meaning to go to Nigeria and Cameroon. But where do you want me to go? Just tell me where you want me to go. Um, I've been avoiding places that have been playing in the Euros a little bit. Just because of quite a few people have done a Euro all the big European sides. Squads. So I wanted to do squads you would not even thought of doing. Like Chile and Morocco and stuff. The Morocco team was ace, by the way, guys. Um, what are we looking at? The surprise player of this... Uh, Salzu plays great. The informed Salzu plays great. And he's only 15k. Um, Sanchez plays great, obviously, but um, a real standout and the craziness of it all is um, possibly Gonzalez on the left wing. He is like 800 coins. Uh, he just took that penalty there. He's like 800 coins and he's an absolute beast. Four star skills, 90 plus pace, gold left winger with a right foot to die for. He's just awesome. And he's like 800 coins. So he is immense. Vidal's immense as well. Don't forget that. Hmm, for a second. Um, but this is this, guys. So tell me where you want me to go. Bye.